I'm Debbie. I'm 16 years old. I'm not a child. Don't you take that tone of voice with me, young lady. As long as you live under my ocean, you'll obey my rules. But if you would just... I am never, never to hear of you going to the surface again. Is that clear? Quite simple. The only way to get what you want is to become human yourself. Can you do that? Oh, my dear sweet child, that's what I do. <laughs> it's what I live for. To help unfortunate merfolk like yourself. Poor souls with no one else to turn to. I'll make a potion that will turn you into a human for three days. If he kisses you before sunset on the third day, you'll remain human permanently. But if he doesn't, you turn back into a mermaid and you belong to me. Have we got a deal? If I become human, never be with my father or sisters again. 
That's right. But you'll have your man. Life's full of tough choices, isn't it? <laughs> oh, oh, and there is one more thing, sweet cakes. No more talking, singing, zip. But without my voice, how can I... You'll have your knocks, your pretty face. And don't underestimate the importance of body language. Come on, you poor unfortunate soul. Go ahead, make your choice. I'm a very busy woman and I haven't got all day. It won't cost much, just your voice. You poor unfortunate soul. It's sad, but true. If you want to cross a bridge, my sweet, you've got to pay the toll. Take a gulp and take a breath and go ahead and sign the scroll. Lots of jetsam, now I've got the boys. The boss is on a roll. This poor unfortunate soul. A Lucas of Ruga come wings of the Caspian Sea. Princess Glossina said, Max Laryngitis, the Volce to me. Now sing. Keep singing. Sing. <laughs> Does love him, doesn't she, Sebastian? Hmm. It's like I always say, Your Majesty. Children got to be free to lead their own lives. Then I guess there's just one problem left. And what's that, Your Majesty? How much I'm going to miss her. <laughs> 